Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you how to make crispy hash browns. So for that we are using russet potato here. We will be making this in our air fryer. So I have peeled the potato skin and washed it thoroughly. Now we will grate it using a grater. Always when we cut the potato, it's, it's a good idea to rinse the starch of the potato. So here I'm taking it in a bowl and will add 3 glass of water and clean the potatoes. We want to remove the starch here. The water is drained out and here I'm adding one egg. We need not dry it using a paper towel or something like that. The potatoes are drained, the waters are drained, so it's good to add our ingredients here now. Next we add two tablespoons cornstarch or corn flour. This is a secret ingredient to make it crispy. Salt per taste. You can also add onion here, onion powder, garlic powder, but I'm adding here chili powder. You can add cayenne pepper. Mix it well. Mix it nicely. The water is coming off but that's fine as I mentioned we did not dry the potatoes but that's fine completely fine we are using air fryer so it's going to be crispy anyways here I'm adding one more tablespoon of corn flour so in all we add three tablespoon corn flour it's just to make it little thick. Here I'm adding 1 tablespoon oil. Now place it on the air fry basket and give it a shape, rectangular shape. Making it little more thicker. So four at a time we can make. If you're making this thick uh, hash browns. We already added one tablespoon oil here. So it's perfectly fine to put it straight into the air fryer now. We need not brush oil on the tray. Now place it on the air fryer, set it at 350 degree Fahrenheit for 15 minutes. In between I opened it and rubbed little oil on the hash browns so that it get crispier and brown on top. And look how gorgeous it looks, perfect crispy yet moist potatoes inside and Look how beautiful the spectrum of golden brown color is. This is a perfect hash brown. And here I made the dip of green onion and sour cream mixed together to enjoy with this hash brown. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Do give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. See you soon with new videos.